This here pixelated ape face, which you could quite easily screenshot right now, go ahead, honestly, just do it, is apparently worth 1.2 million US dollars. That's just one of several bonkers ideas cropping up at a new frontier in the febrile world of crypto finance. Great fortunes are being made, of course, but more intriguingly, the future of how we all experience art, play games, and even share memes is looking ripe for revolutionary change. So join us today as we voyage through the crypto looking glass and ask exactly what are NFTs. An NFT, or non-fungible token, is essentially a database record on the blockchain that refers to a unique, specific digital asset. That asset might be a song, or a GIF, or as we've seen, a pixelated doodle of a chimp in a do-rag. At Tech First, let's look at NFTs through a slightly more familiar lens. Bitcoin, like all cryptocurrencies, derives value from scarcity and the icy mathematical certitude of the blockchain. Central governments can't mess with it by printing more, and the ledger is ironclad secure. NFTs harness that same principle to offer reliable proof of origin and ownership as they pertain to artistic assets. The non-fungible token isn't a work of art in itself, by the way, but it is a certification, engraved forever on the blockchain, providing priceless proof of provenance and authenticity. Baffled yet? Let's look at some more weird examples, like our blocky eight buddy back there, that some dude actually paid $1.2 million for just for a giggle, then delve into what it all means. Okay, remember Neancat? The adorable viral Moggy and Pop-Tart hybrid who sailed out of the stars and into our hearts back in those carefree innocent days of 2011. Creator Chris Torres marked its 10th anniversary with a remastered edition of the classic GIF that just sold, via the magic of NFTs, for the frankly ludicrous sum of 300 Ethereum coins. That's about $590,000 in real money, or if you like, a three-bedroom house in Los Angeles. I'm very surprised with the success, Torres told Nasdaq, reasonably enough, but I think I'm most glad knowing that I've basically opened the door to a whole new meme economy. It isn't only daft animal pictures making big bucks in this brave new world of NFTs. Short video clips of basketball games are also doing a lively trade. One depicting LeBron James dunking on rival Nemanja Bialica recently changed hands for a whopping $208,000. NBA Top Shot, the brand under which the league sells such moments through NFTs, is a bit like that old school hobby for collecting sports cards, but with video. Investors are already splurging over $100 million a week on these moments. Jesse Schwartz, the high roller behind that 208k LeBron clip purchase makes a point of mentioning this lavish buy in his bio Twitter, suggesting he did it at least partly for the flex or show-off value. We really can't emphasize enough that these clips are widely available completely for free on YouTube. So the growing popularity of NFTs, remember, that's the database entry on the blockchain proving the buyer owns this given dunk or that particular cat meme, is arguably a kind of conspicuous consumption, akin to Lamborghinis and Hennessy, only without any Lamborghinis or Hennessy. Still, there are positives. NBA Top Shot was created by forward-thinking software house Dapper Labs. It works on a revenue-sharing basis with the NBA and the Players Association. This blueprint is seen as a guide to the future, with fans, essentially investors now, taking on the role of old-school patrons, supporting their heroes directly. Dallas Mavericks owner and celebrity billionaire Mark Cuban reckons Top Shot could be one of the NBA's main revenue sources over the next few years. And by the way, it isn't just spectacular dunks and deft layups doing a roaring trade on NBA Top Shots. One excitable fan just paid $100,000 for a clip of New Orleans Pelicans power forward Zion Williamson